वंदे गुजरात Good morning children how are you all i am fine and i hope you all are also fine children today i will tell you two stories let's see on the screen children see the pictures on the screen children you can see the pictures of two stories on the screen one story is about the pigeon and an ant and the another story is about two swans and a tortoise who are good friends now let's divide the stories we will see the first story The first story is about a bee and a pigeon. You can see that a bee was drowning in the river. A bee was drowning in the river. A pigeon saw it and tried to help it. the bee sat on the leaf and saved itself a boy picked the stone to hit the pigeon as the boy tried to hit the stone at the pigeon the bee bit him and saved the life of pigeon now children we will see the another story i had told you it is the story about two swans and a tortoise who are good friends there were two swans and a tortoise the swans were going to another place and wanted to take the tortoise with them they got an idea you can see in the picture the swans flew the tortoise with the help of a stick nice idea children 
but you know children the tortoise had the habit of talking he was very talkative and when flying the tortoise started speaking and it fell down now children we will again recall these two stories a bee was drowning in the river a pigeon saw it and tried to help it the bee sat on the leaf and saved itself a boy picked the stone to hit the pigeon as the boy tried to hit the stone at the pigeon the bee bit him and saved the life of pigeon let's recall the another story there were two swans and a tortoise the swans were going to another place and wanted to take the tortoise with them the swans flew the tortoise with the help of a stick when flying the tortoise started speaking and it fell down so children you have enjoyed both the stories the first story was about the boy the bee and the pigeon you can see it the pigeon is having a leaf and the boy who tried to hit the pigeon and the another story was about a tortoise and two swans in the first story you have learnt that if we help somebody and do good work and when we need some help we also get the good reward because you can see when the boy tried to hit the pigeon the bee helped the pigeon so i want to give a good title to this story i have thought kind pigeon good title yes the title of my first story is kind pigeon now let's see the second story the tortoise flew away with the swans with the help of stick but it had the habit of talking useless talking so it fell down what title should i give yes the children are saying talkative tortoise very nice good title so children we have seen two stories kind pigeon and talkative tortoise in the same way children we have activity number 11 on page number 74 in your textbook it also contains two stories story 1 and story 2 now before i read the story i will introduce the characters children the characters of story 1 you can see the picture of a king his name is shibi you can read shibi the king the another character in the story is hawk the third character in our story is dove lord indra and yam lord indra and yam bad mitro tame sambhlyu che ne yamraj mrityu na raja temni vat che a let's see the characters of story number 2 you can see the picture of a hunter the another character is a bird 
in this story also we have a king and his prime minister you can see on the screen bird hunter king and his prime minister now children you know the characters of story 1 and story 2 story 1 and story 2 it is given in your textbook now first i will read the full paragraph and we will try to divide the two stories in different tables children i am ready with my activity 11 you also open in your textbook children pay attention activity 11 work in groups here are two stories all mixed up read them separate the jumbled sentences then write each story in the given space give suitable title to each story children pay attention we are going to start our story shebi was a generous king there was a special bird once lord indra decided to test his generosity one day the hunter saw it he made a plan with the help of yama it dropped pieces of gold from its mouth while singing one morning king shibi took his seat in the court he got a lot of pieces of gold and became very rich he decided to give the bird to the king as a gift just then a dove indra fell near shibi's feet it could not fly then a hawk yama came in chasing the dove the king was very happy with the gift the dove requested the king to save him the hawk demanded for the dove the king said to the prime minister about the bird the king said to the hawk don't kill the dove i will give you as much meat as you want the prime minister did not believe this and said to the king the people of the kingdom will laugh at you but the hawk said i don't eat anything killed by others if you give me your flesh equal to the weight of dove's body i will take it so the king set the bird free at this point indra and yama appeared before shibi the bird sat on the top of the palace it thought 
there are four fools in the kingdom they are the hunter the prime minister the king and myself the king said to his men cut my body into pieces and put them on the balance they praised and blessed shibi to bar mitro tame joyu ke jare hu read karti hati tyare evu lagyu ke ek vakya bija vakya sathe talmel thatu nahi karan ke aa akha paragraph ma be stories che banne stories मिक्स कर लेट सी द स्टोरी चिल्ड्रन वी हेव सीन इन द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ कैरेक्टर्स ऑफ स्टोरी वन देर इज अ किंग अ डव अ हॉक लॉर्ड इंद्र एंड यामा नाउ वी विल प्रोसीड विथ द स्टोरी अरे वाह बार मित्रों बहु सरस पिक्चर से किंग शिबी इज देर इन दिस पिक्चर ही इज गिविंग स्वीट्स टू पीपल शिबी वॉज अ जेनरस किंग ही ऑलवेज हेल्प्ड द पीपल इन हिज किंगडम नेक्स्ट वंस लॉर्ड इंद्रा डिसाइडेड to test his generosity he made a plan with the help of yama you can see in the picture lord indra is talking to lord yama lord indra is talking to yama one morning king shibi took his seat in the court just then a dove indra fell near shibi's feet children you can see lord indra had decided to test king shibi so he took the form of a bird indra bhagwan e potane ek pakshi na swarupe raja ni same prastut karyu it could not fly you can see children the bird is injured blood is coming out from the body of the bird so it could not fly then a hawk yama came in chasing the dove children you can see behind the dove a big bird hawk who was actually yama came running behind the dove in the king's court the hawk demanded for the dove bar mitro राजा शिबी ना दरबार मा एक पक्षी लहूलुहान पड़ू तू पाचड़े वास्तव में यम था एनी पाचड़ पाचड़ आया राजा शिबी ने कीधु के आ पक्षी मारो शिकार है हूँ लईने ज जाइ द डव रिक्वेस्टेड the king to save him now let's see what happened next the king said to the hawk don't kill the dove i will give you as much meat as you want you know children shibi was a generous king so he told the hawk that i will give you meat but please don't kill 
this bird. Hawk said, I don't eat anything killed by others. Hawk khubaj jiddi hato. Te rajani vat manyo nahi. Te ne kidu, if you give me your flesh equal to the weight of the dove's body, I will take it. Children, you can see the dove bird is sitting in one side of the balance and the hawk has demanded same amount of flesh from the king's body and then only he will leave the dove. Bhaar mitro tamhe joi shako cho the king has decided to give equal amount of flesh which will be same as the weight of dove. Now let's see what happens. The king cut his body into pieces and kept them on the balance. At this point Indra and Yama appeared. Barmitra tamne khabar chhe na? Je dove bird hatu te vastav ma raja indra hata ane je hawk bird hatu te vastav ma yam hata bhagwan indra ane yam banne jana raja shibi ni dayavan pravrutti ni pariksha leva avya hata ane temne lagiu ke raja shibi पोता ना शरीर नु भाग पण एक पक्षी ने बचावा माटे आपी देवा माटे तैयार छे तो राजा शिबी तेमनी परिक्षा मा पास थाया दे प्रेस्ट एंड ब्लेस्ट शिबी तो बार मित्रो मजा पड़ी ने फाइनली लॉड इंद्रा एंड यमा टेस्टेड King Shibi and blessed him because he has passed the test given by God. Now we will see story number 2. Are you ready? I have brought nice pictures for you. Let's see story number 2. Let's see the characters of story number 2. There is a hunter as I have already told you, there is a hunter in the story, a bird in the story, a king and his prime minister. So now, let's see what has the story to tell us. Wow, this bird is so colorful. Green, blue, red. All colors and something is dropping from its beak. So this bird is very special. There was a special bird. It dropped pieces of gold from its mouth while singing. Very special bird. But what happened? One day, the hunter saw it. Barmitro, shikari e jare a pakshi ne joyu. Tiare ene badha sonana sikka. Lailitha ane bhega karine potana kare laigyo. He got a lot of pieces of gold and became very rich. Children, you can see in the picture, the hunter is having a bag which is full of pieces of gold and he has become very rich big house good clothes and good ornaments in his ears and on hand he decided to give the bird to the king as a gift 
बाढ़मित्र आप जो ही शको छो शिकारी ए पक्षी ने पकड़ी ने पोता ना राज्य ना राजा पासे ले जाये छे अने ये वो विचारे छे कि हु जो हु आप पक्षी राजा ने भेंट मा आपिश तो मने खुबज सारु इनाम राजा तरफ थी मर्शे The king was very happy with the gift कोने ना गमे एक पक्षी जे गाता गाता सोना ना सिक्का मोड़ा माथी पार्टो हो तो तेवु भेंट तो बधाने गमे ने बार मित्रो हवे जो ये शून्य थाये छे The king said to the prime minister about the bird you can see prime minister and the king are talking and the bird is sitting in the lap of king the prime minister did not believe this and said to the king the people of the kingdom will laugh at you mantri e raja ne kidu the people of the kingdom will laugh at you so children what did the king do so the king set the bird free the bird sat on the top of the palace તમે જુઓ પક્ષી ક્યાં જઈને બેઠો મહેલ ની ઉપર ઇટ થોટ દેર આર ફોર ફૂલ્સ ઇન ધ કિંગડમ દે આર ધ હન્ટર ધ પ્રાઇમ મિનિસ્ટર ધ કિંગ એન્ડ માય સેલ્ફ કારણ કે બાળ મિત્રો શિકારીએ જયારે પક્ષીને જોયું કે તે સોનાના સિક્કા લઈને अमीर बनी सके तो ये पक्षी ने पोते राखी सकता शू कर पक्षी राजा ने भेट स्वरूप आपी तो ये मूर्ख थो राजाए कि बात साची है तमने आत मंत्री ने करी पर मंत्री कहवा एमर हस से पक्षी ने जवा दीद एट मूर्ख श्रेणी में गणाया અને બાળ મિત્રો મંત્રીએ પણ એક પણ વાર તપાસ ન કરી કે વાત સાચી છે કે ખોટી છે અને એમને પણ રાજાને સાચી સલાહ આપ્યા વગર એકદમ ઝટથી નિર્ણય લઈ લીધું કે આપણે આ પક્ષીને રાખવું જોઈએ નહીં એટલે રાજાએ એમની વાત માનીને પક્ષીને છોડી દીધું એટલે જ પક્ષી જ્યારે સ્વતંત્ર થઈ ગયો એણે વિચાર્યું કે આ રાજ્યમાં બધા મૂર્ખ છે શિકારી પણ રાજા પણ તેમના મંત્રી પણ અને હું પોતે બી તો બાળ મિત્રો પક્ષીએ પોતાની જાતને મૂર્ખ કેમ ગણ્યો હશે તમે વિચારી શકો છો સ્વાભાવિક છે જ્યારે એ ગાય છે ત્યારે સોનાના સિક્કા પડે છે આવી સરસ પોતાની વ્યક્તિત્વની વાત એણે જાહેરમાં જંગલમાં આવી રીતે રજૂ કરી દીધી એટલે શિકારી તેને પકડીને લઈ ગયો એટલે એ પોતાની જાતને પણ મૂર્ખ ગણે છે મજા પડી ને બાળ મિત્રો તો બાળ મિત્રો ખૂબ મજા પડી ને યુ હેવ સીન ધ સ્ટોરી વન એન્ડ ધ સ્ટોરી ટુ ચિલ્ડ્રન આઈ હેવ રેડ ધ સ્ટોરી ઇન ધી ટેક્સ બુક એન્ડ ઓલ્સો આઈ હેવ ટોલ્ડ યુ ધ સ્ટોરી અગેન વિથ ધી હેલ્પ ઓફ પિક્ચર્સ એન્ડ આઈ હોપ યુ હેવ અન્ડરસ્ટુડ ઇટ નાઇસલી So children in the next class we will divide the sentences given in activity number 11 into two stories till then keep reading the story tata